right here. Crossfire, crossfire. Okay, I gotta get cover. Is that a woman with a beard in there? Hey guys. Welcome back to LSPDFR. Today we're going to be playing a little more... Hmm. Detective. Yeah. I guess. It's not really a detective suit. It's more of a... FBI just suit. Let me find it here. Yeah, it's just this. This detective. I was going to wear this, but it has no arms. And this just looks strange. So, I just went for the suit. And, yeah, it looks the best. Also, today we're going to be investigating another homicide because of how well we did last video. Oh, well, yeah. How quick it went by. Personally, I don't think it's just how well we did, more of just how the murderer just stuck around. And that's literally like rule one of crime don't stick around so last video we used the charger I believe the 2019 charger Hellcat charger and this video we're gonna be going for a cruiser just because I feel it I feel like it fits better So I'll go ahead and start the car. There we go. And we already have uh, the waypoint going there. So I'm going to set us in route there. Call 18, show me in route to the homicide situation. 10 4 18. Hey, what are you doing? You're blocking traffic. Okay, well this is a right hand turn, so I'm allowed to do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna head over there, no lights, no sirens. So Because it, it's not really an emergency. Seriously? It's not really an emergency. Oh, you're lucky on that one. There's nothing there. Yeah, it's not really an emergency, so I'll just go there, no lights, no sirens. Um, Center Street, units respond code 3. And what the hell was that? Okay. Well, there's a driverless car over there again. That's why I never just linger around Mission Row, because around Mission Row, that stuff is always happening. Also, I've noticed this with other LSPD far YouTubers as well. Why we just randomly went from uh, all this berserk shooting around as a regular officer, just going around getting to shootouts. Why we stopped that, and well, it's because we don't always need to be going through the bang bang shit pow. As I said to Benzo. I said that to Benzo on one of his videos that he made two years ago that I just found. And it was literally about an investigation, so it it actually showed me that we don't need all that bang bang shit pow. So yeah, I, I just decided to switch over for a couple of videos, just go for something a little more simple. Actually get into one of the callouts. And I tried searching for another investigation callouts mod, but it I didn't really have any luck. 
So, yeah. I'm gonna try searching again, and hopefully this time I'll have better luck. Anyway, we are starting to get pretty close to this. And I already know that in... In, like, every call out, you at least need a little bit of bang bang shit pal just a little bit just to spice it up a little like a welfare check there's just nothing it's just hey you okay okay good bye bye and it's just like nothing at least put in a rest like something but again we also need it to be realistic so it doesn't always have to be just it doesn't have to be something so action it can be just something small. Copy that, like the welfare check, so it doesn't always need to be big, but I prefer bigger call-outs. But then again, I try going for accurate LSPD fire, so can't really say. Because that's really just the world. Why are there so many traffic lights? Come on. Come on, traffic. I'm running out of things to say. So, what have you guys been thinking about? Uh, not really just in general, but more of an LSPDFR. What do you guys think about my content? And... Do you really want me to continue... Ugh. What was that? Where did my brakes go? My brakes were just non-existent there. What the... Hold on, let me just give myself better brakes so that... So it just doesn't happen again. Uh, brakes, there. Yeah. Okay, so... Uh, what have you guys been thinking about the LSPDFR content that I've been making? Like, just my general LSPDFR content. Will there be anywhere I, I should improve? Because I just want some feedback from you guys. Is there anywhere that I'm doing wrong? Somewhere I should uh, do better? What the... That Cherokee is going places. But if they pass by another cop, they won't be. Okay, here we go. Damn it. Got caught in another red light. Don't hit me. Because I just feel like that my content isn't good enough for you guys, so I try improving. Only things, only thing is, I don't know where to improve. So that's just where I keep stumping myself. I want to improve, but I don't know where I improve. Okay, so where is it? Up here? Again? The homicide is here again? Paul 18, show me 1023 on the homicide. Ten four eighteen. Morning, sir. Hello, sir. Can you tell me what you saw? I was just around the corner when I heard the shots. I ran around. I ran around and saw the poor guy in the ground. Did you see anyone? Uh, I saw a girl. I saw a young girl run to the store over there. Hey. I literally just did this yesterday.
This is exactly what I did. Hey guys, welcome back to LSPDFR. Today, today we're going to be doing a high risk arrest. So this is going to be a high risk arrest warrant. And the suspect today is going to be Sophie Parker. I already have her on the tab here. Here she is. She doesn't currently have an outstanding arrest warrant because we already have her. We already have her in sight. We know where she is. We know where she is currently. She's, uh... I personally don't know where she is. I'm about to find out. But, uh... Right now, I think that she's at home. And we're about to head over there and arrest her from inside her home. Either that or she's just gonna walk out. I honestly don't know how this is gonna play out. Just out of context here, I have never played this call out before. So this is the first look at it. And this is part of agency callouts. So yeah, I won't be using any partners today. I tried bringing some in because I wanted to like debrief them in here, but uh, I don't know why. Stop the pet doesn't, stop the pet just breaks when they show up in here. Well, not exactly the exact, not exactly the entire menu, but uh, yeah, the partner does. The partner just spawns and doesn't move. So instead, I'm going to spawn them down here one and it's happening again yep bye bye okay well i guess no partners for today and is my gun holster gonna work it is not that's a shame but anyway i'm gonna head over to the garage and to answer your question, no, I did not just jump off the ledge. I did not. So this is going to be the cruiser that we use today. <clears throat> this is the unmarked cruiser by Emergency Distributors. So it's a really neat car. Oops. Uh, wrong way. Put it into first gear and I'm supposed to put it into reverse. Keep forgetting that. I know it's not like a. Uh, I know it's not like real, but in real life, I'm I'm just like more cautious when driving. I don't know why. In simulations, it's probably because I know it's fake and it's not gonna affect me. Unless it's really, unless it really is. But uh, yeah, I'm just less conscious. Is someone gonna open this gate? No. Am I just gonna nudge through it? Yeah. Okay. Paul 18, uh, show me en route to the high risk arrest warrant. 10 4 18. Okay, so. I just want to go in there, lights and sirens, because it is high risk. And because it's high risk, it means that not only is it risky for us to be doing, but it's also a hazard to have them roaming around the streets because they could do anything. Rampage. Rampage at any point. Uh, so they could rampage at any point. Uh, they, they could do anything, really. At any given time. Okay, so they're here at the store. Shots fired, shots fired. Be advised, shots fired. Uh, postal is 373. I'm grabbing my rifle. Unit needs immediate backup. Near Little Soul. I don't know where to shoot. FBI! Hands up, Sophie! Rises. Not 
I want to bring you in. I'm going to try to taser. I know it's going to be a big risk. Got her. Hands up. Hold your fire. Jeez. What the hell, you guys? Come on. You guys just killed her. What the hell? I was supposed to bring her in, you know. Okay, yeah, I get that that the greatest country on earth doesn't take kind of to scum, but that wasn't supposed to happen. We were supposed to bring her in. She had an arrest warrant. You know that, right? Yeah, maybe I shouldn't just call it a shots fired. I should just call in for like code three backup. Hey, hey, just so you know, I want your I want your badge number. Name and badge number. I'm gonna be turning I'm gonna turn you into your sergeant. Yeah. You heard me. Name and badge number. On your sergeant's desk. And why it's there. Okay, so while this becomes an active crime scene. I'm gonna have to close off the roads, or not really close off the roads, but close off the parking lot, mostly. These doofuses are gonna have to get out of here. Anyway. I'm gonna have to go a 1022 on that. I'm already occupied with a crime scene over here. Dispatch, I'm gonna go 10-6 over here. Paul 18. Yeah, I just gotta go 10-6. Dispatch, uh, going 10-6 on postal 373. Thank you. Um, ocean one. We have a civilian in need of assistance. Okay, so I'm gonna search her for anything. I just wanted to see if she had anything that I should have been aware of before the officers shot her. Because now, now it doesn't really matter. Uh, she had a set of lock picks. Okay. No gun permits, electronic cigarettes, full pack of cigarettes, and loose change. Okay, so you can also see that the officers shot the car. So, I'm gonna have to get, like, uh, something to do with it. I'm gonna have to get something for it. Um. I don't know all the letters, so... I'm gonna try it. Dispatch, can I get a play check? X-Ray, Adam, Darren... Otis zero eight two. No. Dispatch question plate check. Yeah, it doesn't work. It doesn't work for me. Okay, so it has expired insurance. That's not. That's not to look for right now. Uh, Jason Williams. Dispatch, can I get Jason Williams on the phone? Um, we're going to be towing his vehicle to a repair shop. One of the officers accidentally shot his car while trying to shoot the suspect. Uh, yeah, so just give him the location of where his car is, and I'll be over here. 10 4, copy that. Is medical aid required? For the suspect, no, dispatch. I'm gonna need CSI. Ten four, copy that. Is medical aid required? 
Negative dispatch. Requesting CSI. 10 copy that. Dispatch requesting CSI, postal 373. No. Assistance required. Quality well, team going 10 sip. Going 10 6. Not 10 7. And it's still heard 10 7. Oh, I think going 10 6. Queen 2, we are on our way. Roger that. Queen 2, units respond code 3. Dispatch requesting tow truck. Okay, so this, I'm gonna get a flatbed. Flatbed, assistance required. And little so. And the flatbed is just going to take it straight over to uh, the repair shop. The coroners are going to take Miss Parker away, Sophie Parker. Yeah, you guys get finished up with her. Careful with the car. I'm going to the car. I'm getting the car towed away, so just be careful of it. Hey man, uh, yeah, just, uh, take the car over there. Take the car over there to the repair shop. Don't take it over to the station. Don't, yeah, don't take it over to the impound. Repair shop, got that? Okay. So while they're taking care of her... Okay, so there. All cleaned up. And, yep. So that's going to be the end of this video. If you guys like this video, please do leave a like. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. And do turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss a future video from me. And do leave a comment as it does help with the feedback and the YouTube algorithm. And other than that, you guys have yourselves a great day. What the hell?